we're here. We're live. We're live. As per usual, um, it never ends. Every Monday, there is a uh, nice general thread going on here. Uh, I appreciate everybody tuning in. This is your main man, your main host, and everything you know and love, King King Man the First of many men that you cannot stand. That motherfucker right there is real. <laughs> so. We are here with our boy and our favorite man we know. Y'all give me. What's going on, big dog? It's another Monday as per usual. So. Uh, a little summary of what happened last time. We did a couple of boxing sessions. That was whatever. We was uh, in a... Um, we got joined into a skateboarding gang. At first, we was gonna go to the Linky Cho house, and now we're with the Blue King. Uh, with the Blue King, um, fighting over turf for the skating board park. Um, and they both, the both leaders of the uh, of the of the gang is uh, they used to be in class together, art class together, and now they're kind of bitter rivals. Um, as far as art everything um because they're both artistic people because they have like their graffiti posted on walls and shit um um and then we also got into um we got into the esports group or the East esports club and uh And we found out that the president, um, that ugly ass motherfucker, decided to um, cheat somehow after we beat him the first time. After after we beat everybody in the club on the video game. Um, I forgot what the video game is called. This is all rise of a fighting game. Um, one of those old school ones. And dude had cheat he had like a whole cheat code in his controller to where uh uh some parts of me trying to move and attack him uh were very obsolete <laughs> then when he got confronted um then he, he finally admitted that he cheated <laughs> And all he was trying to do was save the club from being uh, uh, dismembered. Oh, that's pretty much what happened last time. Let's tune into what's going on this time on Judgment Call Monday. <coughs> oh, shit. I wasn't expecting that kind of work. If you haven't already, follow us. Subby. Whatever you're doing to support Shot Town Gamers, please do so. We are everywhere and nowhere at the same time. I appreciate those who have supported us thus far. Um, there are many of you that have, and we see you. We acknowledge you. Um, we have uh, shout outs in, daily on the uh, on the uh, description uh, description box. So. Um, just please continue supporting Shot Town Gamers. Uh, our main source, our main channel is on YouTube. Let's, let's, I have to get that uh, announced here and make sure I promote what is the point of us being everywhere. It's because we're trying to source everybody back to our YouTube. And if the YouTube does not uh, follow through like we wanted to, of course, we still have everywhere else that has been supporting us. We're here for y'all, too. So no one is excluded. But just say, please, help out your boys as soon as you can. All right. All right, y'all. What do you want to do today? What we want to do? I think. This is me thinking here. I think. We're not really needed in the school right now. Everything is pretty much outside the school, if I'm correct. 
So, because we have to meet up with uh, uh, Azawa, right? To. Ooh, oh, excuse me. I'm burping in my. It's because I'm drinking this ginger beer. Um, how did I miss that? Uh, yeah, most of the, most of the problems that we having, or most of the uh, storylines that we need to do, it is outside the school now. I don't think we messed with the esports games. We already did that little Sega story. <laughs> Sega, yeah. <laughs> Sega, yeah. Mm-hmm. That's the way it, it crumbles. The cookie crumbling, fumbling, bubbling. Ooh, electric. Damn, I wasn't expecting to hear my voice yell. Uh, electric. Uh. Purpose, Electric purpose, Electric purpose, Electric purpose. Thanks. Uh, thanks for thanks for coming on, man. Uh, thanks for the follow. Yeah, man. No problem, man. No problem at all, man. At, at the end of the day, we all trying to grow here, man. We all trying to grow here, man. No doubt about it. You can't change a tagline. Void man. <laughs> it's the shadow man. You can't change that, bro. <laughs> oh, that's hilarious. That is hilarious. But I thank y'all for tuning in, man. Because, you know, I I made I try to make it a thing where Judgment Call Mondays matter. Um, I'm getting... I'm getting some uh, insight that uh, the things I'm doing with Judgment Call Mondays is a bit repetitive, but I feel that what we're doing here, solving these problems, dealing with the school stories, because technically the school stories is a DLC, right? Um, but like like I said, the school stories itself is a lot of shit that we, if you were here on the journey with me with the school stories, it's a lot that happened here. Like, it, we did it with, like, five or six stories. All for the same case. Like, it's ridiculous. Um. Okay, what's the main story right now? The main story right now, it looks like it's going to be dealing with the skateboard game. Um. We still don't really have no info about the boxing. Um. Because all, all I'm doing is really just uh, school story stuff. We haven't really done the side missions like that to, to figure out, okay, if it's actually following up to, to what we're doing as far as the timeline. So, it looks like the only thing that's available right now is uh, with the Lynching Show Hounds. But since we're affiliated with the Blue King, you know what I'm saying? We got we to gotta do what we got to do, you know what I'm saying? We got to get it how we get it. Wait a minute. Get it out of get because if we look here, oh, uh, pull up my phone. Let's look at the task, right? Uh, school stories, right? Uh, oh, I have to go to the Potter's Club. Um, let's see, we're still talking about the professor. The professor is the main villain that we're trying to find out. Uh, X, question about Kimia, okay, I'll get you the lynching show. Pounds, uh, biker gang? Bike? When the fuck? Hold on. When the hell? We just had a biker gang? Okay, now I'm a little bit interested. See, it's, 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 it's five different things happening all at once. We still gotta do shit for the robotics club? I didn't know that. We didn't gotta do nothing for the e uh, esports club, which is good. I think we finished that story. The boxing, we still need to find out. We still need to know more about the professor. It's 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 a lot happening here. It's a lot happening here. Are you back? Appreciate that, man. Uh, how's your day going? I, I didn't even get a chance to see your stream, bro. Because I literally, uh, as I I was like, I see that you were alive. Um, uh, and then when I clicked it, all I heard was <laughs> "Bye, guys." I was like, "Damn, <laughs> I totally missed it." <laughs> I was like, you know what? I'm gonna drop a follow anyway. Maybe it'll, you know, maybe 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 it might work out. Maybe it won't. I don't know, but 
Uh, anyways, um, so I think what I'm gonna do, I just ended as soon as you got there, yeah, for real, like, I tried, I tried, man, I tried. Alright, so what I'm gonna do, I'm gonna go do the little bit, I'm gonna go back to the, I'm gonna go back to the school. Ah, shit, I almost forgot where to go. You get lost in Lake Control. It's almost a wrap for you. Okay, uh, temporary passing. Okay. Bro, you ain't gonna find me on school grounds. I bet you won't. <laughs> I bet you won't. <laughs> Alright, so we're gonna go back in and we're gonna figure out about the biker gang. If we're gonna fuck with the biker gang. Uh, at least I'm here now. Well, I, I definitely appreciate you tuning in, man. Uh, I try to make it, make it where everybody, uh, is welcome here. Uh, I already posted on the Gilded. Uh, if people haven't uh, stopped by the Gilded, uh, I guess I can post it on. Would hurt not to. Mm -hmm. Post the Gilded just in case anybody else that shows up, uh, they know where to go. Join the Gilded. Um. So, Electric, what, what do you know when you play, bro? What do you normally play? Let's go back to uh, MRC real quick. I didn't even get to see to see uh, what you actually played in whatever. Amasawa. Hey, I'm a Sawa. Want to talk to me about something? Yes, it's about the new community, one that just became a part of the city's underground. Okay, city's underground. Yeah. What are we talking about? This city is all. I'm dealing with everything in Lynchy Joe. I haven't done nothing uh, with the uh, Camaro show at all, bro. <laughs> it's free. It's freaking crazy. Um, so what type of club we talk about this time? Athletic, cultural. I try at least to go all to the channels I follow then when they go live. Uh, I appreciate that. That's that's always good. Um, can you also uh, follow our um. Uh, our uh username i forgot uh, yeah our username that way we can build up the numbers man i keep forgetting about promoting that i mean the channel is always good but i wish they would they would add more um i wish they would add more um from the channels and just add them up as a whole but you know you know how that goes man I don't think it would. Hold up, that might. I like how Twitter likes to to do some slow. There we go. That's what I'm at. All right, back to the show. No, it's not really a club per se. Uh, it's not. Why she got that concern on her face? What's she talking about? It's more like a safe place students made for themselves outside of school. And honestly, is what what most would be called a motorcycle game. I don't know if they got a motorcycle game in this high school, bro. Like, what the hell? Man, this is crazy. We do a variety of content with more ideas coming all the time. Yeah. Yeah. Is it just you by yourself? Because, I, I mean, playing a variety, it is. It, it definitely will be a, a big thing. A big toll for one person to do, you know. Uh, the largest uh, motorcycle gang in Lich Show, they call themselves Made in Heaven. Why would you call yourself a motorcycle gang for that? I want you, I wanted you to go undercover among them. Might as well hear the details, okay? Made in Heaven. What kind of how? It felt like that's a whole Christian motorcycle gang. They feel like made in heaven. <laughs> made in heaven uh trademark. That's crazy. Um so made in heaven, okay. So what kind of people are we uh, are these made in heaven folk? Uh well in general motorcycle gangs fall under the one of the two categories, wolf packs and illegal racers. This one is a group of illegal ra uh racers. Okay, illegal racers. Uh, so you mean the street racers? Yeah. Mm-hmm. 
They are obsessed with speed. I'm speed. I'm speed. Lightning McQueen. Only the real ones know about Lightning McQueen. <laughs> Only the real ones know about Lightning McQueen, man. Lightning McQueen was lit. I don't care what nobody say. <laughs> I'm speed. I'm speed. Lightning McQueen, bro. Pulse really quick. Letting everybody know to tune in right now. Right now. <laughs> I'm speed. I'm speed. Lightning McQueen. Yeah, damn. Uh, this not like the wolf pack. Motorcycle game who tends to ride around in a big group, uh, getting the get in the way of the cars. Get in the way of the cars. The main and heaven leader had a lot of power and influence. They call him the their uh, represent representative. Okay. What's really interesting is how they race using abnormal methods, even compared to other street racers. Okay. Aside from how insanely fast they go, they also perform a lot of dangerous maneuvers on purpose. So if it's on purpose, maybe they just testing their own bravery. True, but it's a dangerous test. The racers can't do anything like attack and interfere with each other. Okay. So we know a little bit about Made in Heaven, their illegal motorcycle game. The uh, well, illegal motorcycle, illegal racers in the motorcycle game doing dangerous stuff. Okay, that's cool. That is cool. Uh, um, can you dig it? Can you dig it? I swear, I like the beat of this. Of the background music. I fucking hate it, but I love it at the same time, man. Dun, dun, dun. Can't tell me you can't rock with that. You can't tell. It's like ja it's jazz music, basically. Y'all can be signed. So, what would you really, what would be really helpful if you investigated this third year kid who just recently joined the game? His name is Yoma Su. Su. Yoma Su. Yoma Su. Yoma. Sue. <laughs> so this kid's are has some uh, relations to the professor. There's no evidence of that, but I think someone with ill intent ill intent must have talked to him into joining. Excuse me. His life has taken quite a drastic turn. Drastic? What do you mean? Suyu Kun has, was known for good grace and conduct. He even uh, he was even a disciplinary committee leader. Uh, you mean he was the one enforcing the rules? That that's exactly opposite of a kid who just joined a motorcycle game. Exactly. So it begs to the question: uh, How did he get involved into a gang activity? Seriously. Um. He had a representation around here. Other kids used to call him the rule hunter. The rule hunter? Okay, hold on. Just because you were like a disciplinary guy? If somebody call you the rule hunter? Like, what the... F <laughs> Look, what the hell is that? <laughs> what, the <laughs> what in the F <laughs> is that? That don't even make sense to me. I don't even want that as a nickname. That just sounds insulting. Just rule hunter. Roar. <laughs> it's like basically calling yourself a mall cop or something. Like, no, yeah, I don't know. Nah. Rule hunter? Nah. Nah. That sounds like a person that would legit snitch on you on purpose. It's like, uh, uh, what's that dude name? It's, it's like that dude from Recess. If anybody remembers Recess from Disney Channel, like, if when you were watching as a kid, that's how you know. You know what's up. You know what I'm talking about. That was also lit. So let's not let's not get anything twisted, baby. Uh, and baby, don't get anything twisted, baby. You gotta love what you gotta love. You talking about? <laughs> you gotta love. You gotta love, baby. Don't ever give me down. Take him down, beat him down. All right, never mind. I'm getting distracted. Yes, if you weren't following the school rules to the T, he'll hunt you down. Even 
go after the really wild delinquents, kids, uh, delinquent kids. He should have be scared of. Okay. No matter who you were, if you broke the rules, he showed up. And that's why he got the nickname, the Rural Hunter. Okay. I mean, if you built the name, it, it, it will definitely make sense. I can't complain about that. Someone like Dad became a biker? That's such a drastic reverse. He didn't just become a biker. He In just one night, he became the representative of Made in Heaven. He climbed all the way to the top. So how did he become the leader of it all of a sudden if he was such a good repre representative in the school being called a wool hunter? Crazy. Big crazy. I want you to know that to the T and it's just just be me. I see it. Mm. Mm. You heard me. The leader of the school disciplinary uh, committee feared as the rural hunter became the bikers gains representative. We have n we have never had a case like this. That's why in my hypothesis is that someone else talked him into this. Someone with ill intent, like I said. Okay, right. All right. So yeah, that's 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 crazy. I like to, uh, you know, if if the narrating is too much for y'all, let me know. Uh, but I do like it. It it really gets me involved into the story, like cause this shit is crazy. Like this dude, this dude is crazy, bro. Yeah, it, it, she he was definitely influenced to join, cause there ain't no fucking way. Either you getting paid to do this. Or something. Because ain't no way you went from uh, being the man uh, telling other kids about the rules of the school to now you just the leader of the fucking uh, biker gang. I'm like, what the fuck, bro? No fucking way. You talking about you a representative of made in heaven? What the fuck that even mean? So there's a night and day contradiction in this kid's behavior. Any idea on how Suyu got involved? Uh, well, the thing is, Suyu Kun went into no, uh, negotiate with the Maid in Heaven himself, since he was the leader of the school uh, dis the discipline committee. He faced off against the gang all by himself. He tried to get the other serial students to leave. Uh, you said by himself. Uh, yeah, they said he didn't even blink as he stared into their souls and told them a new one. Okay. The other uh, Siru students said that he, uh, you need to get the hell away from this group. So he was trying to be a hero, but then he ended up being a zero because he probably got his ass beat. That's probably what happened. Because there ain't no way you're going to do that. Mm -mm. No way, bro. Hard to tell if he's gutsy or he just lacked the common, common sense. But how did a student so dedicated to the rules and discipline become their leader? Pretty strange, right? Yeah. Absolutely. Yeah, that's for damn sure. Uh, and I admit this case has huge my interest. Okay. Okay. Uh, request to Yagami. Uh, uh, by the way, when you said undercover, what do you mean? Basically, join the fucking gang, Yagami. <laughs> of course I did. I hope you know how to ride, Yagami-san. So I'm gonna be riding a motorcycle? Nice. Seriously? You can't be serious. There's two what there's two things I want you to do while you're undercover yeah, me son. First, find out why Suyu kun will suddenly become the leader of such a bunch of miscreants. I very much need an answer to that question. And if you can, I want you to talk to these kids who are doing such dangerous bike stunts. Try to get them back on the right track. At this rate, they're going gonna end up dead in an accident. Okay, well, I'll give it a shot. Where do I find them? Some of the uh, Made in Heaven guys seems to hang around in uh, Hamakata Park at night. I have Kento bring my father's bike to you. Can you meet him at the Hamakata Hamakata Park this evening? Okay, once it's nighttime, I head over to Hamakata uh, Park. Oh, Alright, so we finally know about the biker game. Bang, bang, guy, bang, bang, bang. 
All right, so we got a lot to figure out here. Um, so we know about the biker gang. I think we're going to do a little bit more uh, investigation for the biker gang stuff. Then we'll do a little skateboarding. Then uh, we do the robot. We do. The, we didn't do the robot uh, club last time, so we'll definitely do the robot club this time. And we, we'll probably end it off there. Um, but I thank everybody for tuning in. Uh, like I said, as long as you follow the story and you basically follow how I reacting to most of this, <laughs> you'll be, you'll be, you'll be in a nice seat, a nice relaxing seat to enjoy and all that, you know, all that fun jazz. Mm. All right. So, uh, where's the park? Where's the, oh, so we're going back over here basically. So we gotta go there in the evening, though. Um. Hmm. How we go there at night, though? I'm trying to think here. Let's go back to Yokohama '99, and uh, let's see if we can sleep to the nighttime. I think we can. It's me. Sorry, my guy. I'm on my skateboard. <laughs> I'm a skateboarder, dude. What do you fuck? <laughs> Yokohama. <laughs> Yokohama. Taxi! Take me to the fucking 99. Where are we at? Oh, uh, no. No. Girl, what the hell? Girls bite? Oh no. <laughs> That's a strip club. That's a strip club. <laughs> oh no. That's a whole strip club, fam. There ain't no way. That's not a strip club. There is no way. There is no way, bro. There is nothing you can tell me that says that's not that. Because I, 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 that is that. What in the hell? Again, my, my phone's starting. Bro, the vibration. What do you want? Hold on, I'm gonna have to, hold on. What the hell? What the hell going on, bro? What the hell? What the wolf? What the wolf? What the tiger? Tiger claws? Snitch. Shush your mouth. Shush your mouth. Shush your fucking mouth. Don't interrupt the art. The fire, the desire, you feel me? Talking about you feel me? All right, um, uh, yo, what's up, fams? Why are you looking on your phone like, what the fuck you doing here, fam? Yo, hey, uh, he put it in the cold, okay. All right, I'm gonna rest here, you know, I'm past the time, uh, rest until nighttime. Dang. All right, it's nighttime. Uh, we're gonna meet up with old buddy, right? Nice interacting, guys. Shit, y'all you know, just quiet as a motherfucker. Y'all didn't want to interact with me or nothing. Y'all just like, oh, so look at this guy, this guy here. All right, so we're gonna meet old boy at the uh, yeah, the biker gang at the park. So everything's gonna lead up. So we gotta go there. We're not gonna take the cab because we need uh we need more money for that. Excuse me, excuse me, pardon me, coming through. Come here, excuse me, excuse me, excuse me, excuse me, excuse me, excuse me. Yeah, yeah. Nah, da da da. Shut the fuck up, bitch. Do not school. No. Bye, fuck boys. Have a wonderful time. Bye, fuck boys. I love the fuck boys. <laughs> the fuck boys can't run faster than me. The fuck? What they thought this was as I'm collecting these random coins. <laughs> I do like a nighttime sky. It's pretty nice, isn't it? It's wonderful. 
just chilling around in Japan, you know what I'm talking about? You know what I'm talking about? Hey, you know, sway, you know what I'm saying? Swelly Mente, Ben Simon. That's why I'm the. Oh, shit, I took a wrong turn. Back on the skate. And I know we're late. Oh, this looks very uh, vengeful. Oh, uh, shit. Nah, not day. Bitch. Now you. Oh, fuck it. In the fuck? How you get a... Okay, hold on. I can't do the wall hit yet? I'm trying to do moves and I... Sh Fuck you, asshole. Yeah, I was trying to hurry up because I don't want no cops to show up randomly. Alright. Because it'd be hard to get away from the cops. In this game, anyway. But they really never show up, though, when, I, when you least expect it. This ain't like Sleeping Dogs. If people don't know about Sleeping Dogs, man, I'm telling you, you need to play that fucking game. That's what I, that's what I would recommend. Sleep, Sleeping Dogs was legit that game. It was that boy, you know what I mean? It was the, uh, an, the alternate version for uh, Grand Theft Auto and St. Drill at the same time. It was like the third best, but I'm, I'm just mad they never followed up with it. Gento, what's going on, bro? Oh, hey, Yagami-san. Uh, you're going undercover as a biker, uh, game banger. <laughs> Bike game banger. Sounds heavy. Well, I imagine you had it hard, too, Kento-kun. I, I was seem to overdo it whenever there's an incident. Yeah, well, I guess so. But that's fine by me. Whenever my sister chases a, a mystery, that's when she looks like she's having the most fun. Uh, she was looking, she was looking like she might have died from boredom uh, before, but she got her mojo back when she started to pursue the professor uh, incident. Oh, really? You really do care about your sister, huh? Well, she does make it difficult sometimes, but yeah. Well, that's the key to, here's the key to the bike. There you go. Very cool. I mean, I got a biker's jacket on, so I should fit pretty nice. Oh, thanks. Also, take this. My sister gave it to me. It's is it, is a helmet. Your outfit for infiltrating the uh, mo motorcycle game for one of the cool jumpsuits. Um, uh, really? I have to wear this? Duh, if you gotta look like one of them, no way you can uh, do it without the outfit. I mean, Yag legit got a biker jacket on, so I think he should be fine. This is getting worse and worse. Come on, Yagi son. Why don't you do it to change in the bathroom? I'll just keep an eye on the motorcycle. Oh, I'm falling in. Sorry. I wasn't supposed to be that loud, but. So, I got a whole biker jumps. Okay, all I need is some.
Yeah, the the boots is what's killing me with this fit. Got the belt. Yo, no, yeah, this is actually foul ball. <laughs> it's too good. He just want to jump out of the shower of MAGA. Shower of MAGA. Okay, laugh it up. You definitely do okay with, with the outfit. They'll think you're a game banger. 100%. No, the fuck they won't. This is actually garbage. Me and Yagami agree to that. Like, that's... This is garbage. <laughs> I was thinking like maybe it's a little cool, but take away the 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 boots, take away the boots, get rid of the the belt. Made in heaven, huh? We'll see how it goes. He looks like he's supposed to be a mechanic for them, not like a street biker. Like, what the... and what's funny is the shit that he has. Wow, they actually wear this shit. Yo, yeah, this, no. Whoever said that this was, like, a bike game banger material, they're trash. Because this is, this is not it. I'm going to tell you that right now, bro. I'm going to tell you that right now. That's not it. This is not it, bro. This is not it. Not it whatsoever. This is complete garbage. Look at them boots, bro. Look at the boots. I want you... <sighs> If the subtitle shit wasn't in the way, look at his boots. His boots is killing me. His boots look like uh uh uh, uh what Kanye you normally will wear type shit. Like it's it's that crazy, uh, horrendous even. I really don't know what really to say about that. That's really, I don't know. I don't know. I can't do it. It's for not only for him but anybody else. This purple guy, he just trying to look like he's trying to be. He's trying to be with Saint Tro. He's trying to be a Saint Tro, bro. He's trying to be a a, a a third street saint. If anybody really gets the reference of saint, the game Saint Tro, hmm. Bro, what the fuck is his name? I'm gonna just say delinquent because I don't even pompod pompadret pompadret. I think I said that right. Papadra, delinquent. Mm hmm? Blonde delinquent. <laughs> Who's that guy? Who's that? You got, you know that guy? Nah, you no clue. He must be a new recruit. Yeah, first day, man. <laughs> what a coincidence. We're all new, too. So, I guess that means we're friends. Yeah, friends. Yeah, I guess so. Taruta Asama. Korichiro Haruma. Okay. Yeah, hey, this is me. <laughs> Hell, <laughs> I'm Yog. They call me Yog out here in these streets. You know what I'm talking about? <laughs> you know what I'm talking about? You're talking about, you feel me? They call me Yog up in these streets. You feel me? They call me Yog. Does that jog your memory? You talking about, you feel me? Uh huh. Uh huh. Uh huh. Nice to meet you all. Uh huh. Hey, hey, what are you doing? You're doing it wrong, man. It goes like this. What? <laughs> if you look, look at me right quick. Look at me. What the fuck are they doing? What? What are, what are they doing? What are they doing? What are they doing, bro? I have no idea what the fuck is actually going on, bro. Because this, what the hell is this? Hey, holla. It's like they trying to be a gang and it's failing so bad, dude. What the hell is this? You got... Elvis Presley in a jumpsuit. Then you got what them Gundam style motherfucker here on the right. Oh, uh, okay. Now we do it all together. Huh? Hmm. I have to do it too. 
It'd be too suspicious if I don't. Nice to beat you. Bruh, bruh, what the fuck is this? I'm, I'm saving the screenshot, hold on. Bruh, what the fuck? Why does y'all... <laughs> This shit is hilarious, dude. Bro, look, y'all look like, yeah, I run this town, sucker. What you talking about, bro? What you talking about, bro? This is my gang right here, bro. All gang, all gang in it. Bro, this shit is hilarious, man. This shit is hilarious. Uh, this is what real bikers do, huh? What you think? Y'all can be cheap. Y'all can be cheap. Y'all can be cheap. Y'all can be cheap. Come on, it's time for the meeting. Let's go. Our rep of uh, Suicide is here today. Makes me nervous, kind of nervous. He's already here. This is moving right along, then. I need something. I need to see what this guy, what kind of guy this is. Okay. You don't even look like real bikes. Like, what the fuck? I wanted to ride the bike. Man, fuck. Incredible. Made in heaven is this big? Yeah. I mean, it's three Lynchy Cho games put together after all. Oh, shit. Three games? Oh, shit. What does that mean? See, uh, Made in Heaven was founded a few years ago. Okay. A guy named Richie. Richie, uh. Murasaki, Richie Murasaki, used to be the leader. Okay, he was the first. He was the first group's first uh rep, legendary hero amongst all the delinquents. He used his influence to merge the three Yokohama street racing gangs into one, a real rock star. Okay, a little background about that. Uh, he sounded like he was amazing. Yeah, but then a year ago, Richie died in, a, in an accident. Uh, without his leadership, Made in Heaven split back into three groups. Uh, damn. Oh, shit. And they explained the, the uh, dangerous stunts, right? That uh, uh, Oswald was talking about. Uh, so what happened? Uh, luckily, Sobosan came on the scene and got all of them back together. Uh, he pulled that off? At, even as a new rep? Yeah, that's right. Some some say Sonosan is the second coming of Richie uh, Borosaki. Hmm. Suyu is more interesting than I thought. How can a guy who was once a, a discipline committee ended up like this? Well, this is uh, Yakubichi. We're all unified now, even though technically three factions still exist. Okay, there's uh, uh, Bakukun Ryu. Then there's the Raging Angels. Then, of course, the main faction made in heaven. Does that mean? So, factions. Huh? So, there's much competition between them. Yeah. Not anymore. Although each of the uh, each of the three groups sees things way differently, they coexist because there is one thing they do they do agree on. Whoever rules the streets writes the rules. Hmm. Ah, oh, so the rules. Ah, he brings the rules to the streets and speaking in their language. All right, fair enough. Fair enough. Fair enough. Uh, the that was handed down from Richie Chu's son, uh, Suyu son, uh, resurrected, and that's how he keeps the team in check. Okay. So you're saying Su Suyu became the guy's represent overnight thanks to a single rule. Right. In the death race where he could have used attack, Suyu-san snatched victory away from the second rep using only speed. Okay. I heard the way Suyu-san rise is exactly how the legendary Riji <coughs> Murasaki is used to. Okay. Whoever rules the world writes the rules. Whoever rules the road writes the rules. Okay. Okay. Some can say that for like truck drivers or, or, or like people that just normally street racers. <clears throat> so I can see that. I have to keep that in mind. Okay. Well, don't let, don't let your guard down, Yakumichi. No, not everyone thinks it, it's a golden rule like we do. 
like ghosts and his uh, followers. Ghost. He's a real mysterious dude who keeps his face hidden under a helmet. No one even knows who he is. It sounds like uh um that one Ghost Rider chick from uh Dorado Rider. Anybody watch that anime? I definitely recommend. Um, Ghost is either is really about race, and he thinks beating beatings are the way to control a team. A lot of time he would fight with the suicide and the other officers his group may not have the numbers but they have the raw brutality okay uh speaking of ghosts well they got a whole bat and shit oh. you really want to kill Dama, then slip some fear and pain, just like the beast inside craves. You get me? <laughs> Who's our first crook? Our leader. But that's the fact that human nature is the equation. Is it out there on the screen? The only language outlaws I'm sure you clowns must know that. Yeah. Hey. And you? Now that's strange. I heard there were only two recruits. Really? Nobody told me. Who got you in? Oh, well, that's the thing. Interrogate. Find out for sure. Yes, sir. Hey, wait. This is all just a misunderstanding. Yes. Yeah, the big thing. Hey, anyone know this shit for brains? One of you invite him? No. Well, it's a bad look. If not a single death to die for. Play this pig alive and get his squeal. Yeah! Hey, stop that shit right now! Ghost, what the fuck is wrong with you? Something about this guy stinks. He won't even say we let him in. Get our code? We don't lay hands on civilians. But we don't know who this shady bastard is or why he's here. We can't risk him being a raw man. That's not the point I'm making here. You know, Ghost, for a man who wears a mask, shouldn't you be giving me the benefit of the doubt? Huh? It's true, no one here knows your identity, right? Because you're always hiding your face. So isn't it just as likely you could be working undercover? What was that? Accuse me of being shady all you want, but when you do it anonymously, Kind of weakens your argument, don't you think? You realize who you're talking to? You're about to get me! Enough! This is uh, really something. How is this motherfucker a high school student? How is he a high school student? He don't look nowhere near like a high school student. What the fuck? Get on the boss! Be careful if we just do nothing! Kanatsu, 
How do you know which one of you is that? Three. Me and him? Uh. It's not for us to decide. There's a system for determining what's right, and it's quite simple. Whoever rules the row writes the rule. <laughs> That's made in heaven's sacred code. Our foundation has mandated justice. So I don't care if it's Jude Idea or the Constitution. Any other rule can eat shit. Remember, our code is king. Everything else is for the peasant. You got that kind of thinking? You want to talk big? Then obey. And if you don't like it, settle your issues with a lawyer. Oh shit. What part of this has to do with me? We're gonna figure out how to deal with you our own way. If you beat Kanatsugi in a race, you're free. If you lose, Kanatsugi is coming for you. So all I have to do is win, huh? Your code really is simple. Not to mention, it's fair. Hey, Sua, if I'm a free man after I win, does that mean I can join Made in Heaven? Of course. No matter who you are, no one can complain if you win. Mm. <coughs> Doesn't matter. The code must be upheld. Mm. Yeah, this guy is definitely not a fucking high schooler because he, he don't got the mannerisms of for it, but... We developed that in the early age. I, I can't complain. I can't complain at all about it. So why not? You know, why not? Listen up. Anyone that goes into the race, punch your opponents, fuck them up as you want. Okay. You think a rookie like you is gonna win on some skill alone? Bring that bat or a knife or something. All right, so we're doing death races now, bro. This see, see, this is why I can't get off of Lost Judgment because this shit is crazy. You're doing skateboarding, you're doing boxing, you're doing uh, 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 robotics, you're doing dance club, you're doing the mystery club, and now we're death racing. What? We're death racing, bro. What? What are we doing here? What are we doing? What are we doing? Uh, overall, uh, your life is on the line if you're racing against factions on the bike game. Okay, each course requires a certain number of laps, and the winner is first across the finish line. Okay, whatever. Uh, the race will start with the opponent being ahead of you before you can uh before you can race a gang leader. You need to defeat all their subordinates. Take them all down by ramming them and using boost. Uh, so I got a random to take them out. Okay. Once you beat them all, then the race uh, against the leader will start. Okay. The finish line is set to the race. Go ahead. Get ahead of the leader on the lap and cross the finish line. and win first. The leader will try to obstruct, uh, obstruct you in pretty much unique ways. So watch out. Okay. Yeah. No need. Of any of that besides, I know what I'm doing on the wheels. Okay. Wow. Interesting. Uh, you didn't pull any dirty tricks on uh to make a top of it, didn't you? Haha, uh -huh. idiot! You're not a song on level. How how do you think you're gonna pull this off? Uh, to the starting line then. If I don't win this, the whole thing is over. All right, let's do it. So we are doing this. I'm not even in a real fucking bike, bro. This shit crazy. Bro, okay, so I gotta tilt left and right, accelerate, brakes, okay. Bro, I'm in a, like a whole fucking moped. Hit B for the control burst of boost. We gain a boost, um, we can do a wheelie, okay.
Bro, if you don't get out of my fucking way. Get out of here, chump. Uh, okay. Yeah. 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 Oh, shit. It does a little jerk reaction with it. Yeah, my way, prompt. Yeah. Oh. Boy mad, boy. That boy mad. Started throwing shit. Shit. I gotta knock him out. Bro, what the fuck? This dude. He he can't get off my ass. This dude not backing down either, bro. No, no. I fucked up. How the fuck? We've been racing around. Like, what the fuck? Oh, stop reminding of reminding me of that. Bro, I can't take this guy out for some reason. Bro, if you remind me of that one more fucking time, bro.
thing is, he don't even attack me. Okay? Now, stop fucking... Start doing shit. Because they still got me in the tutorial part. Get off of me. Alright, now. Let's do this. Shit. I'm getting tired of doing that shit. Let's go. Yo. Yep, yeah, son of a bitch. I beat him in a fucking moped. <laughs> oh, okay, I get some cash too? Fuck yeah, I took... Damn, I, I almost had this whole shit destroyed. But I was trying to figure out what the fuck am I doing, you know? It's weird, man. Okay, my appeal goes up, okay. That's crazy how we doing all this crazy shit. I beat their asses with a fucking moped, bro. A fucking moped, bro. That's a moped. Right. <clears throat> no, boy. Trying to shoot out them fucking fireworks at me and shit. Yeah, I know you feel like shit, bro. <laughs> ah, you beat them, huh? You beat him. You beat him down. Take him down. Take him to town. Uh, you beat him. Not too shabby. What's your name? Yag. My name is Yag. Yag. I remember that. I'll be him. So you got to keep your word. The rule is absolute, right? Of course. You all better remember this Yog guy. As of today, he is a member of Made in Heaven. Look at him, he got the bag. Look, yeah, this guy is not a high school student. I don't give a fuck what y'all say. This guy is not a high school student. He's not a high school student. There's fucking no way, bro. There's no fucking way it is. He got the, the swag juice, as, as people will say. He got the swagger like us. Um, uh, but yeah, so it seemed to work. Whoever rules the road writes the rules, and as logically, when I beat Su Su Yu in the race, then he will be more likely to listen to me. Then I ask him what I really need to ask. Uh, could I even ask him to span the motorcycle gang? Mm. Hey, Su Yu son, what? I want to race you. What I gotta do? What I gotta do for that? Oh, it's not that easy. I may be willing to acknowledge you, but you're still small time, dude. You're a small fry, basically. You're a small fry, Yog. You're a small fry. I don't write small time guys. First off, you need to beat the three leaders, and they're among. They're all almost as fast as I am. Do you mean the leaders of the Bukaran? Ryu, the Raging Angels, and then Ghost Faction. If I beat them first, you erase me? Yeah. You have my word. Great. This could take a while. Yeah, that sounds like a good storyline. Uh, it's probably going to keep my true goal of dismantling the whole game a secret for now. Yeah. 
Yeah, this this is yeah, this is crazy, dude. This is crazy. You know, doing a death race against racer gang, bro. What the fuck, man? This shit is crazy, bro. This shit is crazy. The shit we be doing, bro. I'm telling you. Yagamek J. That was amazing. Hell yeah. When his ghost sets his sights on you, you were like a goner. Yeah. Just almost pissed myself when I saw that. All right. In celebration of Yakabichi joining the maid in heaven, do you want to do that thing again? Again? Sure. Yoroshiku. Yeah. Yoroshiku. Gang, gang. Yoroshiku. Gang, gang. Bro, I'm saving the screenshots, bro. This shit is hilarious. Yoroshiku. Yoroshiku. See you, Yakami G. Great work out there, Yagami san. You look like you really fit in. Even some pre edgy type, but you fit in just right. Okay. Um, yeah, you're very observant. This outfit really suits you. No, oh, shut up. By the way, Azua. Uh, what should I do about this motorcycle? This is no place to park it. Well, uh, that. There's a garage that my father rents nearby. I'll take you there. Tony, why is these high schoolers doing so much of these big ass stories? Where are these? Where are the grades be going, bro? What the hell going on in the classroom? Is this it? Yep, it is. Wow, it's kind of fancy, a little bit. My father said, they said I could use it whenever. That's generous of him. You know, like, what? She's into mysterious shit. She's not a, like a mechanic. What the hell is she going to do with this? What is she going to do with this? What the hell is that? She's not going to do anything with this. What the hell? I mean, that's just a cheap property he keeps leasing. And on that note, he sends his regards. He said, leave the bike here and it'll get fixed up. Gotcha. Nice. I'm gonna need to take advantage of what I get yeah, of that when I can. Okay, cool. We can customize it, practice runs without a boss. Death races come to the garage at night to enter to the next death race, change rides. So if you have multiple motorcycles, you can swap them. Nice. Yeah, because if we got, if we, oh, we only got one. I wonder how you can get another motorcycle now. See, you see, now you got, look, you got me more involved. I'm more in tune to do this more. Bruh, we're not gonna pretty up the fucking moped. That's, that's for damn sure. Um... I said, let's give it, a, let's give it a practice. We'll do one run and then we'll go to the skateboard. Three, two, one. I'm basically doing a wheelie. What the fuck? <laughs> Bro. Why well, gotta be 12 with these hoes?
come over and not drive it. I'm not hitting the accelerator. That's also what I'm not doing. Oh, great. It hit me. You hit me. You hit me. Why you hit me? Both of y'all asses get off. Yeah. I mean, I get paid for it. Shit, almost 5K? Why not? Alright, now my uh, appeal is at, at level 3. Alright, now I gotta get my guts up. It's okay. I'm gonna leave the garage. It's pretty good. Got to be here at night for it. Oh, so that's where that's at. <laughs> Travel out some more. Um, we are the nightlife, yeah. We're the nightlife. Street life. Sorry, old lady. Street life is on my mind. It's the street life. Oh, they did he do anything at night? For sure. I mean, with a skateboard game, I don't think it, it fucking matters, bro. By the day and night, can I hop up? Oh man, I wanted to hop on the car. I just at my time it was off a little bit. Oh, uh, oh shit, hold on, let me get the coin. No. Locker. Fuck. I just want a freaking coin. I guess I'm gonna get it later. Bye, fuck boys. Ah, shit. Damn it. Why you gotta be a bitch? Y'all bitch asses. Oh, 
Fuck it. Miss me. Miss me. I was trying to hurry up and disarm him. It didn't work out. All right. All right. That's enough with that. I can't believe that. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Okay. That was cool. All right. Um. What up? What up, peeps? That could be sad. You better head out to the park. Coming along. Sure. Let's get the skateboards on. I'll tag along. Blue game, blue game. Blue king, blue king. Blue king, baby. Oh, these guys again. You guys again. Y'all gonna be signed. It's time for us to get our revenge for the last time. Fine with me. Who am I up against? Me. Get ready. You're up. Uh huh? Yeah, I'm starting it off. Okay, you're gonna start it off and you're gonna suck. All right, let's go. You look, you got cuts again. Okay, 2500 score. Okay, okay, I enjoy my turn. Okay, I gotta beat this guy. All right, Blue King, Blue King. Shout out to the Blue King. Yeah, let's go, y'all. Damn it. Hmm, boo. Yeah. Now I always skip over that. I did a whole trick. Oh, I did a perfect. Okay, I didn't ever do I get a perfect score on that one. Well, I blew your shit out the park, bro, without even trying. 76. Hunt it, bro. Get out of my face. You ain't about that life, bro. You ain't about that life. Dude, trash. Talking about some, yeah, I did 2500. Bitch, I did 76, bro. Blew your ass right out the water by 5,000 points. Go fuck yourself. Looks like I won. Yeah, Ben looked like I won. What the fuck? We don't play that shit. Right, let's go. Fake ass thug wearing a do-rag. Get the fuck out of here, bro. Yo, Chiyota. Are you the one who's been drawing the Blue King stencil? What? No. Someone else in my group draw that. Why are you asking? All right, my bad. I forgot. You you can't draw for shit anymore. We really did see the downfall of Tita Saitota, artistic genius. <laughs> so 
So he want to talk shit after his boy, one of his crew members lost. Real professional. Like, like real professional. You really, you really talk shit for that long. And, you know, I don't know. I don't know, bro. I really don't know what, what really to say about that, but at least a sour taste in your mouth that you're a, such a hater. I never knew that he was such a hater, brother. He was such a hater, bro. He said something about the last time with the whole thing about the artistic genius. Uh, that's all in the past. Uh, but if you want to know, I'll start drawing. I started drawing in the middle school because my art, art club teacher. Talk to me into it. it was, I had a knack for it, okay? Uh, then I started improving pretty quickly, and I managed to win awards and stuff. And I saw people calling me a genius in the newspaper. Uh, have you ever considered pursuing the path of career then? Yeah, there was a time. There were times when I thought I would be an artist when I grew up, uh, but that's not going to happen for me anymore. Why not? Six months ago, I had gotten surgery for a condition in my hand, and now my hand's all messed up. It doesn't affect my everyday life, but I can't draw delicate lines anymore when I need it for my art. How the hell you had surgery already? What the fuck did you do to your hand, bro? I never knew that. Yeah, but anyways, that's all in the past. This fucker's on having fun now. Mm -hmm. Bro, what the hell are y'all buzzing about? What the hell is this? Shut up. You interrupted my kung fu. You want to talk about some shit? They got nothing to do with my black ass. Shut up. So, uh, we did that. That was pretty cool. We beat their asses right quick. Uh, and then, uh, I think we need to go back. Oh, wait, look, it's a side case at night. <laughs> what else is gonna happen at night? Streets be thugging sometimes at night. Do we want to put up the Dukes up? No, we, I said we can't. We gotta go to, uh, okay, we gotta go back to Yokohama 99 to get some rest, right? Then we'll go back to the school and do the robotics, and then we'll, we'll basically end it from there, because we are already an hour in. I appreciate everybody that has tuned in thus far. This is pretty cool. Oh my god, the glitch. Wow, a simple bump. Excuse me, fuck boys. Ah, uh, shit, motherfuck. How you gonna... Bro. Bro. Get rid of the fucking sword and fight like a man. I kicked him in the balls. Motherfucker! No! Ah! I'm about to die. Skateboard, hit me. Move out of the way. I'm gone, I'm gone. You ain't gonna touch me, fam. You can't talk me shit. Blue King Turk, Blue King, Blue King, Blue King. Hey. Motherfuckers, no! Why is all many gangs over here, bro? Escape park, bro.
Get a fucking... I say, where the fuck is the taxi cab? Damn taxi, what the fuck? It's taking you forever. All right, let's go back over here. Commercial District 99. Oh. Bitches be crazy out here. You know what I'm talking about? Like, like you can't, you can't. Get my rest up, you know what I'm saying? Get my health up. I'm out here dying. I'm just gonna pass the time, you know what I mean? Mm -mm. Well, yeah, I know y'all don't mind me crashing y'all car. I mean, crashing to y'all, uh, you know, your place, you know? This is like second home, you know? Appreciate the second home. Uh, to, I appreciate everybody that's tuning in right now. We are definitely an hour in. We got uh, one more hour in us. Uh... Kick up the old gym. Uh, skateboard there. Taxi, man, look. The, the economy already going to shit. We need to save our money as much as we can. Uh, make sure y'all pay y'all debts off. You know what I'm saying? They're definitely, uh, oh shit. Nice. I ducked them hoes. You know what I'm saying? They ain't even recognize my face. Um. Yeah, pay your taxes, pay your dues, pay your you pay your credit off. You know what I'm saying? I want everybody at a at a at, if you're not if you're not up there big numbers, shit, get up at like, you know what I'm saying? Get up to six six uh six ninety or something. No way. Who the oh shit. Nope. Yeet. Yeet yeet. Yeet yeet. You know what I'm talking about? You know what I'm talking about, you feel me? Yeet yeet. <laughs> Fucking Jay Uso, bro. Can't even get that out of my head sometimes. Ah! Why don't let me do a trick right on the fucking shits, man? It's insane. Well, there's a case out here at night, but I ain't gonna do that. Uh, I'm only gonna do what we can. Um, oh, anybody in the chat? Anybody here, bro? Come on, man. Come on, man. Anybody's in here? Come on, check my man. Check my man. What we doing? What we doing? What we doing? How we doing today? How we doing? Yo, what's going on? Who the hell is this? Nope. No promotions, bro. Ah, oh, man. God damn it. It's always one of those. Always one of those promoter bros. Um, I wish I had mods, bro. Ain't gonna cap. <laughs> Alright, let's head over to the robotics club, which is on the fourth floor. Am I correct? Uh, on the fourth floor. Spottom gang got you lurk pretty much man. Appreciate you man as always with the lurks. If only I knew how to fucking fuck. You know, it's always something. You know what I'm saying? If it ain't one thing, it's always another. We went through we went through the hallway where we wasn't supposed to. I got distracted. Sorry. Um Okay, the fire just went away anyway, so let's go up to the fourth floor. There's only like one staircase that can go up to the fourth floor, but it's hard to find that hole sometimes, so we could just take an elevator. Let's go to the robotics club. Uh see more through about the uh what the hell? Uh <laughs> What up gang? How y'all doing? What's going on here? Sekiro raccoon. You got a minute? Huh? What's up? I grabbed some tea with a uh, Korea in my in me again. Oh, this sounds great. <laughs> Gonna go buy some snacks. Boy, this really didn't have had to do that. Ijikura. Let's head over to the cafeteria. Yeah. 
All right, so we gotta do more investigation. So many, we gotta go all the way back downstairs. Oh, god damn it! We gotta go back all the way downstairs. Just go to the cafeteria. Ow. Uh, one more slice there. Mm -hmm. Oh, okay. So we're here at the cafe. In the cafe. Cafe Tiria. I'm a material. I'm a to material girl. Who is that in the fucking corner, bro? Oh, it's just dudes talking. Okay. Uh, looks like uh, we are missing a person. What's up? Alright, there we go. It's a Kura Senpai. I bought potato chips. I even got your favorite flavor. Calls me. Not bad. Oh, how sweet of you. Oh uh, yeah, he yeah, he's definitely uh he's definitely trying to trying to swing in the right direction with her. Mm-hmm. He trying to get he trying to get them kudo points like he wanted. Mm -hmm. Nice. Next time I get the drink too. Maybe I get a ginger ale. Okay. This guy, uh, this guy is covered. Uh, the price is no subject. Well, fine. I suppose it's a necessary expense. All right. Anyways, uh, sucker raccoon. I uh, think you could take a look at this. I'm sorry. Wait, what's this? So this is a death bot that's been uh, been the talk of the town lately. What? A death bot? I heard rumors about it, but this is the first time I've seen the real thing. Um, this robot. What's up? I think I've seen a robot like this before. You have? Where? Um, well, 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 I remember. Uh, the robotics club room. What was that? Seriously? Uh, so you know the locked cabinet in the room? Inside is a blueprints the robotics club uh, had made over the years. Whenever the president let us look inside before, I just saw a blueprint for a robot with arms just like this. So you sure about this? Mm, I don't know if that's identical, but it looked very similar to the robot in this picture. We thought the robotics club would have had the know-how to make a death bot. But this could have the they could have sold the blueprints to outsiders, and if they if that was the case, <laughs> hmm, suspicions are mounting, huh? Uh, sucker coon, who has the keys to the lock up blueprint cabinet? I'm pretty sure it's the president. Just the club president. The revised club's most important assets are its ideas. For years, the president has always had been the one who was rigorously managing them. Hmm. So that means. That means he's he's the only one who has who can pull off with the blueprints. The lock cabinet. If I could take a peek at the blueprints inside, that would be uh definitive proof. Okay. Interesting. So that means we might more likely have to break in entering. That's where that's uh that's where we're coming up with this conclusion, Mr. Yog, sir. Mr. Yog. Come on, run up the stairs. Come on, come on, come on. Speed it up. Come on, y'all. Come on. You know, you got the athletic legs. You got the out, out. It's the front. Okay. All right. What's going on, y'all? How y'all beat me up here? Y'all was just in the cafeteria. What the fuck? Robo Labo. Inside the cabinet, of the, all the blueprints of the robotics club have drafted over the years. Probably wouldn't be the, uh, a good look if the counselor was unlocking it on my own. Something the matter, Yakimisa? Nope. nope, nothing at all. Oh, all right. I guess I need to stay undercover in the robotics club and see what I what else I can do to find out more. Okay. Uh, yeah, just, you know, stay in tune, basically. Alright, let's head to practice, why not? Unlock some new parts. Alright, what are we doing? Mr. Cayman? 
Uh, this ain't not Mr. Cayman. We need to figure out some things. Um, uh, uh, compact power. That's a lot of new parts. Okay. Except the battery. I love my pistol. You know what I'm saying? My pistol. My pistol game on flute. Keep the shield for right now. The gorilla haver must do a lot of damage then. Hmm. Uh, all right, let's. Let's give it a practice. We haven't done this in a while with a robotic cell. Let's uh let's give it a shot. I want I want my I want my bot to have a fucking gun though. Look at the first one. Nope, we're taking that too, bro. Yeah. You ain't getting that either, bro. Nah. Bro, I gotten so much better in the robotic club, it's ridiculous, bro. Oh. They got that. Fair. Oh shit, okay. Give me that shit, bro. Give me that shit. Y'all dog water, bro. Y'all dog doo doo, bro. Your dog doo doo. Your dog doo doo. If I can only get more to IP data. I mean, we just beat, we just swept on them boys. Okay, we're back on this particular map. Okay, well, I got I got mines with the pit. I got at least I got the man with the pistol. Let's go. Where's the plane gonna be at? That's mine. Try it. 
That's also mine. I tried it. Nah, that's mine, son. Don't be mad. Okay, yeah, I got that. Sorry, friend. Hey, get off me, bro. Oh, I do a fucking tase, bro. That's crazy. Damn it, I can't get it yet. Fuck. Chomp. Well, at least I like this one. The drill was cool, but I get to electrocute them and do it like a big ass hammer. Throw them all. Ooh, plus 15. Oh, yeah, that was big dub. Big dub. Okay. Big robo game. Big robo game. Robo, lobo. All right. All right, there we are. Perfect. Now we are ready for the main tournament. So this is the fi finally the first round, huh? Ah, uh, the woman. The one that was being very flirtatious with me. You got a moment? Akasensei. sensei what is it? You're here too, Yagami Sensei. Excellent. Mm hmm. An acquaintance of mine happened to be a police officer, and he asked me a curious question. A police officer? Don't tell me. There has been a report of frequent death in Linky Cho's performed by robots. So, as a robotics club advisor, they asked if I could get your thoughts on the matter. Not as suspects, but simply for reference. Hmm. Oh shit, we're cracking down the coal now. We're cracking down. Oops. No wasting time here on this on this kind of question. No, 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 uh, no, no need to re uh, redeem. Okay, that's 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 something. Uh, then this acquaintance described the th the thieving robot, and I got me it got me thinking. I might have seen this. This isn't good. That cabinet. You recall allowing me to see the documents in there previously, yes? One of them, one of the blueprints I saw at the time looked rather similar to the theft bot. Go ahead and say, what are you trying to say? Don't worry, I haven't said anything to the police yet. But you should know. This is trouble for me. In the event you are acting unfavorably, it will fall under my management responsibilities. We don't know anything. Are you sure about that? Because I think it'd be better for you if you were just being honest with me. Oh yeah, she trying to crack down the coal. Basically, she knows that it's his ass. Is good is 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 with the with a theft bot, bro. What? You gotta be kidding me. This is not going well. Now what do I do? Uh I was <laughs> tough situation, but it is kind of uh uproared. 
to be like, you know, point the blame. Like, I know you did it, bitch. I was like, I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. I'm trying to keep up with my own investigation. But then she just blankly just like, yeah, I know he fucking did it. The fuck? Uh, but right now, everybody's really against her. And it's hard to really... Hard to really do anything. So... Excuse me. Uh, you say you have gone to the police yet? That means you're planning on going to do them now? Now that all depends if the, if the members have the right attitude. Huh. Attitude. So are you saying... The robotics club must disband. On top of that, if if you get rid of the blueprint, I wouldn't say a word to the to the police. So you're basically under the assumption that they are the ones with the theft bot. Okay, so you just automatically assuming they're guilty. That's not the judgment call. That's not the judgment call. You tried it, bitch. You tried it, bitch. <laughs> But making statements like that, when that's your actual stance, is essentially in, uh, uh, stagnated. The robotics club is tampered with evidence. Tampered? That's a, a vicious thing to say. <laughs> you know, I could have to say, this guy's a lawyer. You probably don't want to say anything stupid. Huh? Oh. Uh, a lawyer? I'm a lawyer, I'm a detective, I'm everything, baby. Former lawyer. Just for the record, if you, if you don't disband, I'll tell the cops is a textbook threat. A teacher threatening her own students, suggesting they're tampering with evidence? It's not a good look. <laughs> what? She, the woman was too stunned to speak. <laughs> So anyway, all I'm asking is for the robotics club to not do anything stupid. Robots are just toys at the end of the day. Play with them in the club room. Ah, uh, she mad. Ah, uh, you mad. Ah, uh, she big mad. Ah, uh, she big mad. I could have didn't have shit to say. Nah. Uh, she went all white as a ghost when Yagami said gave her gave his counter argument. <laughs> it felt so good. It felt so great. Thank you, Yami son. She didn't seem to respond to her reason, so we always struggle with her. I'm angry. I hear, I hate hearing our robots just being called toys. Oh my god, like, so politically correct. Fuck that bitch. We need to win this tournament. Yeah. Right. Let's show her what robots can do. She never calls them toys again. Yeah, you said it. Let's show the crumb, crumbly teacher what's up. I'll give it a shot. Yeah, I get fired up, eh? Yeah, damn! Yeah! <laughs> <laughs> Sweet and simple, this bunch. I guess it was just a lucky break. She just managed to bring everybody together before the main tournament. Yeah, give me time. Let me know when you're ready. We head out to the first round of the tournament. Alright, first round of the tournament. Damn, we're not even at, we're almost at level five, ain't gonna cap. Let's uh make some modifications real quick. Uh active funds has increased with thirty thousand. Okay, do that. So we got some increased money. Let's uh let's develop some new stuff here, right? So we need some we need some stuff. We need some stuff. I need my movement speed. <laughs> Give my mini bot some some love, you know what I'm saying? Is that a sniper? Hey, yo, what? Elephant cannon? Bro, what? What the hell am I do with an elephant cannon? <laughs> These motherfuckers crazy. Like, <laughs> shit, bring the firepower. Fuck it, cause at this point, this shit crazy. Mm 
Give me that motherfucking. Mm. Ain't a one minute my don't make me the one, you ain't not the one, you was some bitch with the dancing fun, huh? I think, can one of them be about, like, storage? One of, I need something that needs to be, to have more slots. Does that mean I need to get a new robot? Maybe. But, there's only one of them that can only have one slot, though, which actually sucks dick. Um, I don't know. Let's rearrange. Alright, so we got our main dude here, right? So he ain't doing melees, he's doing ranged attacks. Uh, it gave him some more ammo. Because he's gonna need that firepower. Let me get rid of the melee strikes, okay. Alright, the Gorilla Masu. Get my movement speed up. Out of that 500. Maybe we need to change out some motors. Uh, we don't get the we don't get the set materials for those. Okay. Jammers. Hmm. I mean, fuck it. Let's do it. We here. We got the robot. Hmm. Do 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 do. We're finally here. Round one of the re Robo Rally Tournament. A battle between Serial Highs Robotics Club versus Me Guy College Robotics Club. Yogg's the only one that gotta be with the fucking badass jacket and shit. Uh, you nervous? Yes. yes. Mega College is a tough opponent. Plus, it's the first time we made it to the main tournament. Up till now, we were lucky enough to lose into the prelims. Now we're suddenly gunning to win the thing? Ha ha ha. Alright, that's enough talk. The start is starting. Now we are ready to kick things off. Let the robots battle begin. All right, let's do it. Let's make it to the first round. All right. Same map. Let's do it. I got my yeah yeah yeah. Gang gang. Let's go. Oh shit, bro. Damn, they collected all this shit. <laughs> Fuck. Shit, bro. Why you gotta push me this far, bro? Nice. 
Bro, what? Damn, son. Yeah, we they, they just straight up dog walked. That was crazy. That, like, the fucking... Come on, skip this whole thing. Just right off gate. Mother F. Bro, what in the fuck going on? Get rid of that motherfucker. Shit. Bruh, it's the drill dude that's like moving so fast. Like, what in the hell? This guy is actually tough. I ain't gonna cap. I wasn't expecting like this much energy coming from this this the robot with the drill on it, man. Like he going crazy. No! Okay. Wow, these guys are tough. Bro. Alright, yes, 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 yes. Alright, we're doing something. Come on, guys. If I only wasn't controlling everybody, in a sense. Are you serious? Bro! Yeah, I might have to switch them up because this man is straight drilling. Yeah, this guy's a fiend. What? 
Mari. Oh uh, yeah, I'm gonna need. I'm gonna have to get that drill back. I gotta custom in it because this shit ain't working. This this gorilla hammer ain't working. I'm thinking like I'm doing shit and it's like this motherfucker. This motherfucker, uh, 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 uh bullshitting. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. I want to win now. Now I want to win. At first, I wasn't really taking it seriously. Now, like, this dude, this drill man, the man with the drill. Look at his ass, just gunning for me, bro. <laughs> Yo, ain't, he's moving way too fast, bro. He got probably more than like three slots of mods to put in. No way he's doing that much crazy damage, bro. That's crazy right now. This is crazy. This is legit crazy talk. Thanks, loser. Shit. Shoot his ass, man. What the fuck? I don't know, bro, what the hell? Why is this dude moving fast as hell? One, we almost won. And then, and then like, the robots itself act like they don't want to do shit. Like, it's not moving fast enough or something. Like, what the hell going on? What the hell going on? Like, what the hell is this? You're supposed to be out here shooting motherfuckers. Not, what the hell are you doing, man? Yeah, because that was crazy. We should not have gotten dog walk for that. I think when numbers just start calling me for no reason. Stop calling me if I don't know your ass. Like, what the fuck? Uh, yeah, cause that this shit is this shit is crazy. Ain't no way we're supposed to be getting wiped out like this, man. And then they got more than they got more than one mod. I can't get no other mods, which is stupid. Like, why not? Why can I not get any new mods? And the motor, we can't get no motors for some reason. I'm trying to think what else we need. I feel like we can beat these guys, but it's definitely going to take a minute. We got lucky with everything else. Now all of a sudden... Bro, right off rip. Fuck 
Fuck you, asshole. Right here. Yeah, bitch. Talking all that shit, bro. Third time's a charm. Well, is that fourth time? It might have been the fourth time, but fuck y'all. Y'all ain't on shit. Fuck. And fucking bastards. Amazing. Serial High Robotics Club comes out on top. Made it through the first round of the tournament. Nice job, guys. Nice job. Shit, they gotta do better with the with the fucking robot with the fucking gun, bro. We won. This is so cool. I'm ready. I'm starting to believe that we can actually win. Oh, who the pretty who the pretty guys? Who the pretty women? At? So you're the cereals robotics club, huh? I'm reading code Moriwaki. President of the Toko College of Science Robotics Club. Toko College of Science? Last year's champions? Champions? Well, that's pretty impressive. The way mo this is way more than impressive. They've been undefeated three tournaments in a row. And they are favored to win this time, too. Really? <laughs> Sorry. This came out of nowhere, but our president just wanted to say hi to an upcoming, uh, up and coming Zero Robotics Club. Uh, I'm Saikoro Sokamoto. <laughs> nice to meet you. By the way, I just checked out your match earlier. Er, interesting bunch. It'd be nice if we could just take over, uh, take each other on sometime. If that's your wish, I'm sure it'll, it'll be granted. At least in the finals. Oh! So you guys are shooting to make it to the finals. Yes. We'll be there. It's a promise. Well, you will, huh? Guess you're pretty confident. It's cool. Hey, except, well, I don't think you're going to end up facing us and facing each other in the finals. What? what? I don't think you really get what the competition is all about. Damn. At first it was a nice green, but really it was just a face-off. Whoa, all right. Some high intentions. I like it. The College Science Robotics Club, last year's winner, huh? Three years in a row. They ain't playing around, bro. They trying to they already did a three peat. They trying to do a four peat. If we're on their radar, then it means we're doing well for ourselves, right? Perhaps. But now we just need to focus on winning the next match. Bet. And teamwork. Yeah, hey, level five on the focus. Five, four, three, two, one. Yeah. Nice job. Nice job, Yog. We made it to round one and oh god, we got another message. Oh yes. No. I don't want a message. Went as well. Uh, Yami-san, can you stop by the club sometime? There's something I want to ask you. All right, then. What could it be this time? Watch. All right, we'll go there, and then uh, we'll just close out for today. Because we have definitely done a lot today. We've done a lot of progression. A lot of progression. What's that? All right, to the, to the first flow. <laughs> Drop it down to the tippy toe. Yo, sir, it's the tippy toe, girl. It's the tippy toe, girl. It's the sippy toe. It's come a rope cho. It's the monofo. He's the monaco. He's the monacho. Yaga me the yada yo. Eeny, mini mighty mo. If this is a new case, I swear to God. Yo, what the fuck? I don't remember this being here, but was that a lie? Well, uh, what do what do you think? Okay, Carson, 
Your, your face is telling me more than your mouth is. I believe I've won. <laughs> is that so? <laughs> then go right ahead. Mm -hmm. Is that Azawa and Koryo? Koropo? Joker? The maid? I lost again. What the fuck are y'all playing? Looks like a good time. Old maid, huh? Just the two of you? Yes, but... We primarily focus on bluffing aspects of the game. Unfortunately, I lost for the tenth time in a row. She's too good at making making me pull the Joker. Uh, there were even a couple of times I got you to take it for the first two two rounds. Okay, not sure if that means Kodoro's uh, card shark or if Oz was just an easy mark. She probably was just an easy mark. Well, I'll be off now. Damn, Oswald well like, you didn't have to beat me like that. <laughs> oh, looks like you two are having fun. And yeah, that's that just wasn't a simple game. It was just work. It just what work for the MRC. Really, playing cards is going to help a case. It is. It's the, I found another community that I need you to in uh, affiliate infantry. This time, it's a casino? Bro, what? A casino? What? A gambling club we need to find out? Yo, how many more stories do we have to get involved? This is, is crazy. We just got into a, into a, uh, a biker game. We just got into a biker game. What the fuck are you talking about? No, no, no. no. It's, 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 it's just as it is. You're going undercover for an actual casino. And so we moved on from uh, uh, opinion detective flicks to doing spy missions now. This is this spy movies now? No, not at all. This is for a genuine case. Okay, tell me about the fucking case. Even though we're probably going to do this next time. So a full-fledged casino. What would I have to do with a delinquent... Serial students. Actually, word's gotten around that a serial student gained access to a casino in town. She'd been gambling regularly there. Okay. This girl? Yes. Kohaku uh, Hayakara. Hayakawa. A second year. Okay. All right, all right. Fill me in the situation. So the casino, what we talk about here. Casinos don't usually let high schoolers gamble, do they? Yes. Normally, they can't even get access to certain such places, right? Okay. But I believe the casino ha Hawakawa-san had been going to... Wouldn't let her under usual circumstances either. Then, how she's getting in? Did she fake her membership? Uh, that's likely, although I don't think it's easy for a high schooler to create a fake ID that easily. Uh, I imagine that she had help from, from a third party. So, the professor, more likely. So, that means, yeah, there's no bigger suspect than it comes to aiding and abetting delinquents than the professor. I think it's, safe to, it's safer to believe that we have a hand in this and it would be to believe he isn't he isn't involved I gotcha considering the professor's connections it's easy to figure at least one of them will be a uh, frogger for, for here frogger uh you know it, i've been doing some reading on the for, uh, frogering lately uh a job often performed from the shadows where fakes of any from Passports to driver's license are crafted into serving all sorts of purposes. Yeah, yeah. yeah. and I imagine some memberships could, you know, some membership card to a casino wouldn't be impossible for them, but they'll be they're impossible to a whole without the cash or the connections. Okay. So what about the kid? So tell me what kind of student she is. Well, she seems to be a decent person. Uh, she's in the board game board game club. Great, I'm gonna be in another club. 
fairly good student, no connections to or records of delinquency. Her representation seems solid overall. But one thing is that I heard that she is very competitive when it comes to games. And not only that, she is very good at them. In fact, she won countless board games tournaments. Nothing seems to phase her when, it, when she's in the zone. Be it uh, strategy, bluffing, or even the, the luck of the draw. Uh, so here, so we're fine. She had to go to the casino in the first place. It was the first place to go. She happened to mention it all a bit too loudly to one of the other members of her club. She said she found a casino that could get her in. She probably had more fun there than anywhere else lately. Uh, also, uh, those games are much more thrilling than we'll be playing in the club. So I wonder, I worry that the thr thrill may end up causing her in the long run considering how she's already ramping up the stakes so like so highly. Or she won rate like, what's her win rate like? Uh, unbelievable as it sounds, she has a perfect record. Hmm, a perfect record, huh? It sounds like she definitely does cheats. Hmm. It seems that, that uh, she has a rather uh, unique talent. According to other board uh, board game club members, she has actually uncanny ability. She has uncanny ability to read people perfectly. Hmm. So she able to read people's emotions and play games with their mind, play mind games with their emotions. Okay. What do you mean by reading, by reading people exactly? She can deduce any opponent current emotions whenever facing them into the in the game. She's doing the base on expression and behavior. No one knows what she does, how she does it. Apparently, she's able to read players who are putting on con uh, convincing poker faces. Okay, wherever it is, though. It made her virtually unstoppable in competitions involving psychological fortitude. Players who get uh, antsy uh, when they have a bad hand or the excited ones with the winning hand, comp all competitors have their tails. And if someone can read an opponent's emotions with a high degree of accuracy, they will be particularly good at games involving bluffing such as poker. So you're trying to, so you're trying, you're trying your hand at her ability when you're playing old maid with uh, Coco. That's correct. <laughs> Unfortunately, I couldn't read a, I couldn't read Kotoko's face at once. On the flip side, she toys with me the entire time. Uh, so Kotoko pretty much just said uh, another hand to aid the MRC into being, into really having a poker face. That's what you're basically telling me. Okay, I see. Well, I think I get the gist of what's going on. So we gotta basically find out where exactly is the casino she really goes to. So where is this casino supposed to be at? Well, about that, since it's on the on the grounds sort of arrangement, I don't know exactly the exact location. One, the only intel I gather so far is that the it's a membership only situation and it's hard to access. Okay. Which means the first step is to find a casino. Yeah. Yes. Yeah, so and if it's anywhere, I expect it'll be around Chinatown. I will tell her th that's where I usually lose sight of Chinatown. Okay. We'll go to Chinatown and then uh, see if she is around there. Okay. Um. All right. And we'll stop it here for today. Uh, this was a lot, uh, a lot that we did today. Um, fuck. I wasn't expecting, I wasn't expecting a whole death race with a biker gang. I, re I really wasn't expecting that. Uh, so that we did that, we joined the Maid in Heaven. Uh, we, uh, fur further along a little bit on the storyline for the, uh, the, the skate by, uh, the skateboard club. So we're in the skateboard club. We're in a biker, uh, we're in a biker game. It's not even really club. So biker and skateboarding game. We're in the blue king and the maid in heaven. And we are, we made it past the first round in the robos, uh, tournament. Uh, and then we're about to get involved with the, uh, casino run, uh, with a chick in the board game club. So, it's, it's, I'm telling you, 
This shit is getting crazy and crazy every time I play this game. And I, I can't really lose interest in it because there's just so many new things happening all at once. I'm just like, damn, how many new cases to we is all connected to this so called professor and we still trying to figure out who the fucking guy is? <laughs> it's crazy, bro. But I appreciate everybody that uh, tuned into the stream. It has been a fun one. It has been a fun one. Um, but of course, we have to go and do some other things. We'll probably be streaming maybe later on today. I don't know. Uh, just, just tune in for that. And, uh, you know, we'll be here. We'll be here. Just support your boys. Just support your boys here at Rumble. Support Shot Town Gamers. Support uh, support our YouTube channel. Support us on Twitch. Support us everywhere. We're everywhere, bro. We're everywhere. We're everywhere in the kitchen sink. Uh, people at the kick. What's going on? Uh, ga uh, gameplay boy. Appreciate you, man. As always. I need to do better with y'all on the chat anyway. Um, but uh, I'll, I'll keep, I'm gonna keep trying my best as uh, as much as I can. Um, but. With that being said, I bid you goodbye, as this is King Heyman the First, signing off. Until next time, kids. We'll see you next Monday on Judgment Call Mondays, playing Moss Judgment. Bye, Yogg. We'll see you next Monday, buddy.